just like looking at the level of production, even though I'm assuming you do it with your phone. So I, I didn't plan on starting off this way. But Natalie, if there was somebody out there who just wanted to like get started on TikTok, they're just starting an account. Like what, what, what's like three tips? You can be like, so just three tips to try. Like, like talk to us, please. Yes. Uh, create as much as possible. I think at the start, like just throwing things out there and seeing what works, that's the best way. I think that's a little bit different than other platforms. For example, Instagram is a little bit more polished. So you care a little bit more about, you know, how you present yourself from the get go. But the way TikTok works and you don't know which videos are going to take off. If you have like multiple sides to what you do, like perhaps you're only into fitness. Well, that's, you know, easy for you. You're like, okay, that's all I can focus on. But if you have all these different areas, see what sticks, like put these things out there and see what sticks. Once things start sticking, try to recreate that as much as possible. I think the other tip is um, to spend a ton of time on the platform originally. Like now I don't spend that much time like scrolling through my TikTok feed, but at the start I really did just to get a nuance of like how things are working and how it works different than other platforms and what's taking off, um, what kind of content is performing well, what kind of content is performing well for other athletes, um, for other creators in, in my niche. So uh, I think, you know, spend a lot of time, put what works out there or you know, test out what works first and then recreate some of those things that are working once they start working.